Hello Dan, how are you? Hi, nice to meet you. Thank, thanks so much for uh, having us here uh, with the Intel Technology Tour. It's really great uh, having you here the, uh, at Taiwan. So, uh, We're happy to have you. And Lulu All about Lake. the PC. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, what's, what is going to be with the Lunar Lake for the consumers and also for the business users? Uh, a lot. This is a, a, big, a, big, <laughs> a big change for us uh, in architecture. We're super excited about uh, announcing and getting into the market here this year. Um, a couple of big things. It's got a brand new core, so it's super fast. It's got all new graphics, so it's got great uh, graphics and gaming and media display capabilities. It introduces a huge increase in what we call our NPU, or it's our NPU, dedicated yeah. AI engine. And then finally, and I think uh, the thing that will be most surprising to folks, is it delivers exceptionally lower power uh, to have great laptop battery life. And I think it will uh, actually beat expectations and, uh, and delight uh, folks who, uh, who buy one later this year. Absolutely. I saw the numbers, uh, the watts. It's really fantastic. Compared to the uh, previous generation, it's really uh, a new era is coming, I think. Uh, also for mobile uh, notebooks and uh, and also I saw these small factor for uh, small form factors PCs. Mm -hmm. I think it's going to be also some new stuff coming up uh, for the consumers, also for the business users, I think. Yep. We sort of designed it for the thin and light laptop, um, the thinnest and lightest laptops. Um, but we'll see in, a, in a, range of, uh, a range of laptop designs, even a little bit more performance-oriented laptops. We have some uh, discrete graphics designs with Lunar Lake as well. Uh, and uh, we even have some small form factor desktops and other uh, interesting and innovative form factors. So uh, we've uh, shared that we have over 80 designs with Lunar Lake uh, coming to market starting later this year. And uh, I saw Wi-Fi stuff, uh, which is also... Um I think it's now embedded in the chip, so it's not an other, another module in the uh, in the platform. So I think that's gonna change also uh, with new Wi-Fi capabilities. What what are we expecting with Wi-Fi? Yeah, we have Wi-Fi seven, so it's yeah. the, the latest uh, Wi-Fi technology, uh, super super fast. Uh, if you haven't made the upgrade to, to 6E and 7, I uh, strongly encourage. I was just doing uh, my home uh, on 6E recently. Oh, wow. uh, so uh, yeah, this is uh, we're moving fast in Wi-Fi. Uh, it has the digital components are integrated, so that allows us to really scale that technology across the vast majority of our designs uh, since it's integrated right into the chip. Um, and uh, analog remains uh, discrete on the board. Uh, but this gives us scale, right? Which is a big part of what we try to do at Intel, which is introduce like, new technology and then get it out to as many places as we possibly can. And uh, one more for, uh, for the gaming stuff. We, we had so many uh, gaming users, uh, so much gaming users in our side. So the, what, are, what they can expect from the new Lunar Lake uh, in terms of like uh, integrated graphics? Can we play games more than ever before? You uh, sure can. Uh, a lot of games run fantastic today on Core Ultra. Um, that's with our, uh, our first XE integrated ARC style discrete, uh, integrated graphics in Meteor Lake. Um, and here with Lunar Lake, we're already moving that a step forward. So this is what we call XE2, which is the next generation. And uh, we'll show up in our discrete products uh, later, uh, which is exciting for our graphics team. So we're really starting that brand new architecture here for thin and light, for mobile. Um, it's got great performance, up to 50% faster than where we are today with Core Ultra. Um, but it's also great for power. Um, so that graphics performance can scale uh, lower, so thin and light laptops. If you want to just have reasonable frame rates, but you just want long playability. Uh, so that's another focus of our, our uh, ARC uh, graphics here in Lunar Lake. Absolutely. These are the things that we want to hear because you know, longer uh, battery life, more performance, and uh, low, uh, low battery usage. Yep. That is what we are looking for. But also for the power users, we have the solution. You have the solutions also with Lunar Lake, I think. Like uh, for the powerhouse, uh, what do we have? Yep, so uh, Lunar Lake performs great. Uh, this is the fastest core uh, we've ever had, highest performance core. Uh, it starts with Lunar Lake, um, and it will be um, a really robust office productivity solution, no question. So those lightly threaded, single threaded tasks, all the, the classic things that I'm doing all day long on my PC, uh, Lunar Lake's perfectly built for that. Uh, for those professional cases and uh, workstations and real workhorse creator systems, often with discrete graphics, uh, we have some cool Arrowlay products coming uh, later in the year, and we'll talk more about those in the future. Um, but uh, you know, that's that's the great thing about the the Intel portfolio is we have a, a broad array of products to address multiple needs, multiple users. Uh, so you don't need to compromise, right? You can select the thing that's great for you. Uh, okay, last question is about AI, which is Intel is focusing right now that I can see. What will change for the AI business, AI stuff? Uh, 
with Intel based the, the like the AIs the, on PC. What what's it going to be for us? Uh, AI is uh, is becoming ubiquitous. Um, so we've all seen some of those really exciting use cases that they call a generative AI, uh, where you can have a, a text uh, prompt that's working with a chatbot or generating uh, images and now video coming. Uh, uh, on the cloud side. Um, so obviously we're in a huge uh, revolution in computing. Um, but this is uh, not something you need to get an advanced degree in uh, to use it. Uh, it will be yes. uh, sort of just integrated across all the things you do on a computer today. Uh, so we're working with all the major software vendors uh, around the world um, to make sure that their AI algorithms get uh, adopted into their, into their software. So whether you're um, doing photo video work or office productivity or just doing you know, video conferencing home or a, with a colleague uh, across the world, uh, we, we want to really harness the power of AI to make what you do better. Um, so it's not, the, not some barrier to, uh, to learn, but just uh, you, you, know, you can enjoy that power performance benefit in your new laptop. Great. Thank you very much, Dan. Really nice to talk to you. So you. Much.